A ground fault happens when a hot wire or component touches the metal housing of the appliance. The housing is now energized, and the ground wire returns the electricity to the source. Electricity will always take the path of least resistance. If you touch an energized housing that doesn't have a ground wire, you might be electrocuted. If the ground fault happens before the load, the circuit is shorted, the current increases, and the breaker or fuse will blow, cutting power to the appliance. Now, if the ground fault happens after the load, there is still resistance in the circuit, so the breaker might not trip. The appliance might still be functional, but this depends on the component affected. To test if an appliance is shorted to ground, you can plug it into a circuit protected by a GFCI, or ground fault circuit interrupter. GFCIs monitor the current between the hot and neutral lines. If there is even a small amount of current leaking to ground, then the GFCI will trip, disconnecting power until it's reset. Components can also be tested for shorts. If the component has continuity between either terminal and the metal frame, then it's shorted to ground and will need to be replaced. If you want to learn more about the fundamentals of circuits, then watch the video linked below. For more troubleshooting on water heaters, furnaces, and appliances, then subscribe to our channel. And if you need help, you can call or visit our name or location to talk with our knowledgeable staff. Thanks for watching.